Alright, so I've finally emptied 15,000 buckets. Uh, I actually did this in two sittings, so yeah, my finger hurts. But yeah, that's that was done. I've also got a few from down there, but time to fill in with sand. Two step easy clue. Ooh. Right, quick explanation for the next few clips. Uh, the CC that I've now joined, we're doing some uh, raids masses, and I went to join in. Uh, I was in Discord with all of them, which is why I didn't say anything, but yeah, these next two clips are from raids. I'll just log out. Oh. <sighs> next time we do even bigger. Snapdragons, <laughs> <laughs> yes. 200 and the ore. Ooh, I got the, tele I, I got the tablet, cool. Nice. Oh, that's sick, nice. Third age. Wait, compare, oh, wait. What um what oh. level of clue is it? Oh, uh, hard. I I just opened it if you were wanting yeah, to. Right. No, I was just wondering like value. Let me know value and I'll try and do better, uh, but it's a master clue, so it probably will be. Well you say that master clues are pretty shite. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> I I got an enchanted hat. This thing looks so stupid. Whoa. Zami page two. Is this one I need? Please be something I need. Also, that's cool, but I'm not going to use it. Uh, let's see. Scroll down to the bottom. Damn it. Yeah, what am I going to get for my caskets? That's so shit. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad I do my clue scrolls. Yeah, that's understandable, really. I'm already at Major Arena, so. Wow, these medium clues are so bad. <laughs> right, you just got a good master, so I'm gonna get a good medium. Or not, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Never mind. Alright, so I've got a medium casket here, and there's also an eclectic, so hopefully I can get myself a medium clue straight away. Well, I think that's new, but yeah, it's a bit meh. Let's see. New medium? Also, nope, never mind. It's a duplicate. I don't know why, but I didn't pause my music here, so I've had to mute the clip, but that is my 50th medium clue. And a quick farming level. Here is 70 farming. And here I have another medium casket. And nothing good. <laughs> and another casket. Uh, unho unholy blessing. Good, but I already have one. You know the drill by now. Nothing good. DK points, I think. I got 8 herbs and 1000 pure essence. I got 12k points. Oh, hell yeah, salt peter. <laughs> Uh, after those last couple of raids that I did, I realized that I could boost to make brews, so that's what I did. Still doing herb lore, still just listening to music, but 78 herb lore. I don't think that really means anything. Oh no, I can make strong uh, raids potions now. Nice. Okay, so this isn't really set in stone, but uh, basically, right now, all I'm doing is collecting buckets of sand. Uh, but I need 2,500 of these, and if I keep getting these at the max speed, I won't have enough of these by the time I've got all of my buckets of sand. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to find something else for me to do. And while thinking of things that I could do, the first thing that came to mind was Tithe Farm. And the reason that I'm thinking of that is because my farming level does affect how many giant seaweed I get per patch. So, having a higher farming level will make it all better. Also, Tide Farm will give me, obviously, the, uh, the XP bonus clothes, uh, and also give me a seed box, which is, which is really useful. So, I've never really done Tide Farm before, so I'm not sure what to expect. Right, so I went to go do some tithe, but then realized that uh, I should probably be on Lunas, and before I switched on to Lunas, I went to go do a farm run, and th this this being the very last thing on the farm run, there we go, 71 uh, farming, just, but yeah, uh, where's farming, yeah, three, three levels until I can, uh, yeah, three levels until I can use the max fruit at tithe farm, but I don't know if I'll really be staying there, like I said, never done it before, so we'll find out, I guess. Alright, so I just did my first 100 fruit. I actually quite like this mini game. Uh, it's not that bad. I, I can, I, I quite enjoyed it to be fair. So I don't know how much XP I'm actually going to get for this. Uh, 21k, and I get 26 points. 
Do I just leave now? Can I or do I get more? I think do I, I think I just leave. Is that right? Okay, so I just did my second run through, so I now have 52 points, and that means I can buy the farmer's boots. Now, normally I would go for the most expensive piece first, but uh, like since um, like since I get the XP after every like I, I, I get XP in lump, so I feel like it's probably better just to be like get the XP to start with. So yeah, boots are coming out first. Uh, I actually do like how this set looks. Sadly, I don't have the whole set yet. But what I am going to do is I'm going to try doing 25 at a time instead of 20. Uh, which means I need yet more watering cans that I don't have. Also, I'm going to need to put some of these away so that I can ha carry the farming set on me. Because uh, I will still be wearing the graceful when doing the actual farming. But yeah, I'm, I'm quite enjoying this so far. See how many, See how far I can get before I need to go to bed. Okay, note to self, 25 doesn't work. Let's see how many of these I can uh, rescue. <laughs> Obviously I could do uh, 24, but then I'd be left with four at the end and it would just be slow waiting for them. So I think I'm just gonna stick with 20. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna put these in, get the XP and then restart so I get the points. But yeah, hey, it was, it was worth a shot. Live and learn. Okay, so I've got another 97 here. I managed to fuck it up, I'll be honest. Uh, <laughs> I, I forgot to water some. But yeah, I've got 97. Hopefully this should still get me the level, though. Yeah. Yeah, easily. Uh, 72 farming calquat tree, tr tr trees. It's pretty good. No, am I going to make it? Come on, please. <laughs> Come on. Oh, Come on. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, okay. Ooh, I'm feeling better now. I got a bit distracted and uh Ooh, that that nearly messed it up. That <laughs> let's keep let's pay attention. Future reference. Right, so as you probably saw in the last clip, I have hundred and twenty nine points right now. Uh this should take me over hundred and fifty. Yeah. Ooh, seventy three farming as well. Forgot that would happen. Lantern time, cool. But yeah, uh the reason that this is uh, special is because you may remember I said I wasn't going to go for the most expensive ones first but after thinking about it I feel like I'm just going to do what I normally do and go for the most expensive one first so that is 150 points I've got the farmer's top now uh, how much is it for the legs? 125 yeah? okay so that's 5 more runs only 8 more runs until I've got the full farmer's outfit nice I don't know why I'm forgetting to pause my music on all of these clips but this is 74 farming which means I can now do the highest level Legovanova Le 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 fruit. I think that's what it is. And then we got 73 Hunter on a birdhouse room just after. And um, Zora Kelsey KC15, I got my first Zolandra teleports. What is that chest? <laughs> what What is that? That's so bad. Uh, okay. Stop. Carol, stop. Okay. Yeah. I, I I just closed it. I didn't know. You, I didn't even know that was a thing you could do. What'd you get? Uh, nothing. Nothing. Thirty k worth loot. Damn it, crap. I wanted that Carol's top. Let's see if I'm gonna get an item or if I'm gonna go thirty dry. Thirty dry. Yay. The big eight zero crafting. Don't need a boost to get glories anymore. And in a few seaweeds, there we go, 75 farming, does this get me anything? Magic trees, oh that's actually quite good. I don't know how many magic seeds I have, but uh, it takes coconuts to protect them I think, and I'm fairly sure I have a good amount of those, so uh, yeah, I might be able to plant some magic trees soon, that'd be pretty cool. Okay, so to give you up an update on the uh, sand situation, oh hang on. Yeah, an update on the sand situation. Uh, I have been using up some of the sand as I've been collecting it. Uh, so as you can see, I've only got 10,000 buckets left. I've got 500 sand, so I've made uh, more or less like 4,500 buckets of sand into glass and blown them. 61 crafting. Uh. Alright, so I've uh, managed to collect enough sand to use up all of my giant seaweed and I accidentally got rid of the placeholder so now my all my bank looks weird but yeah there's um uh yeah I've got 8,600 of these I think I need around 10,000 so 
I don't quite have enough, so I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to move on to blowing these while I collect more giant seaweed and yeah, move back and forth. It is now 20 to 5, so hopefully I can get this done by the end of the day. And 82 crafting. I'm fairly sure I forgot to record 81. Uh, I guess I guess you'll find out in the video, but yeah, that's that's 82. Three more levels to go. Okay, uh, yeah, lot, lots to do. And any second now, I should be getting 83 crafting. Uh, come on. There we go. 83 crafting. Nice. I need... Uh, what is it? 5,300 more glass? Uh, I don't quite have that much, but I'm fairly sure this should be able to get me there, and I have been collecting the seaweed as I go, which is why I'm here right now. So, I, I should be good. It's currently uh, 10 past 10, so I, I have literally been doing this all day. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, I should be able to get 84 before the end of the day. And uh, yeah, start Zora tomorrow. I just said that and then realized I still need a Zenite and an Onyx, so I'm nowhere near. I should hopefully still, as long as I don't go like super dry, I should still be able to start Zora tomorrow, but I'll probably have some PVM to do tomorrow, like uh, Gorillas and then Barrows to get Chaos Runes for an Onyx. Okay, so I've finished all of my orbs that I have. I still need another 11,500 XP. How many orbs is that? That is 221 more orbs. Uh, okay, I've still got to go collect these for today, so I'm going to assume that with the sand that I have and the steps that I will have, I should be able to get myself to 84, and then go try and get myself the uh, Zenite, and then the Onyx. Yeah. Alright, and with this last battle staff, this will be putting me onto 84 crafting. Whew, this means I can now plus 5 boost to get to 89, which is the level required for the Ring of Suffering. Now, like as nice as this is, I now need to go get a Suffering and an Onyx. The Onyx will be relatively easy, the way I'll be doing that is just Barrows till I get enough Chaos Runes to be able to buy one. But the Zenite, I just need to go kill Gorillas. I'm already over the drop rate, I'm about 350 KC. So hopefully I get it soon, because I don't really want to go dry on it, because I do want to actually kill some Zora this week. And, uh, yeah. Barrows is fun, though. I don't mind Barrows. And gorillas are fun, so it's not going to be bad, but I just don't want to go dry. And that is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed. If you Like if you did, and I will see you in the next one.